Maggie. I'm Andrea. And, and we, we are, are the Seashore, Seashore Stitchers. If you're joining us once again, I guess you've seen our other episodes. Uh, we thank you for coming back. Um, if you are new to our floss tube and to the Seashore Stitchers, thanks for joining us. If you like what you see, please subscribe to our channel and like the video. Yeah. Helps people find us. Yeah. <laughs> um, like us. So what are you going to work on while we... Okay, I, uh, I'm working on my little Halloween witch, spinning yeah, witch. I'm not sure yet because oh, okay. I want to talk about it in wet. She's working on the spinning witch. Because I made a, a really funny mistake. Oh, I guess we're both doing spooky Halloween stuff. I'm working on the witch's brew project that I hadn't had too much done on last time. So I think I'm going to make some progress on that. Um, so we just got off of a virtual knit in the pit because as I said, we also knit. Yes. We had a lot of fun virtually, but we did also attend the... Knit in the Pit, Asbury Park. Yes, at um, the Tuesday. Baronet, it's called, at the Asbury Hotel. Yeah, up on the roof. Um, so we got in a little knitting time there. And my yarn was featured. I'm yes. an indie dyer if you're That's just great. joining us and you don't know. And my mom here is a bag maker. She right. makes project bags for stitching and for uh, knitting. And so I featured a skein of yarn for specially made for Knit in the Pit. So if you haven't yes. checked out Knit in the Pit and you like knitting, really exciting. you should check them out. John Giswold is awesome. Awesome. And it's a lot of fun. It goes on Zoom. Check out Knit in the Pit or John Giswold on um, Instagram to find them. And we'll put the stuff below. Um, yeah. The information because Knit in the Pit is just great. I got to get on one other time, but it's been like over a year now he's been doing it. Or just came on a year and I've never gotten to go and I love that Andrea and, and um, my husband and uh, her father and her husband we all went the four of us it was so cute yeah. they were so supportive that it was so nice yes yeah, all of fun. the people were lovely they really nice were. way to meet new people too that are crafty. it was yes we did social distancing so none of us I didn't get that weird like panic I gotta get a mask off yeah. Like, I didn't have any of that. I was excited yeah. to be there. And we all had our chairs. We all sat in our know, groups. Yeah. In our little group. And um, even single ladies, they came. That uh, I don't know if they're single or not, but they met each other. They were single coming there. And they met each other. And they're like really good friends now. I know. That's so, so cute. sweet. And it I really think was. some of them definitely I can do remember stitch. their names. Most of those knitters. Do I, I imagine they do. Yeah. yeah. I imagine that. So we had a lot of fun this week with Knit in the Pit. Yeah, so we, we did. So we had like two really long sessions with yeah. just a bunch of crafty we got to make with all it. the people and, and then listen to their convers conversation. was great. Um, it was awesome. This is part of um, work. I've had an exciting week dying. As I said, I had that skein come out. Uh, that colorway for Knit yep. in the Pit. Themed by Asbury Park, that beach where they uh, get together. Mm -hmm. And so I've had an exciting week dying. Mommy, you've had a lot of bags. Yes, she's been selling my little bags. Because I only do a little because I'm disabled. I have a lot of pain in my head. Like like I don't have that. Hours. I have to have a lot of medication and it's really hard. And time to rest. Um, and I have to yeah. rest. So she's been selling the little bit I can make. And it's just fun. And I always did pretty good in my Etsy shop. Like the... And no one's ever been like, you know, I want that bag. Why am I that bag? Like, I've never gotten any kind of, like, they respected that I only put a little bit in and then I do a little later. Like, I don't do it constantly because I can't. Yeah, so we've know? had a, a nice week. So we've had a good time. You know, and I got a little money that I can now go to the we stitch store. We are so store. excited. We want to go to the stitch store. Stitch store is so City. bad. And we, we keep not so being able to. So this week we made stitching money because we're going to go yes, to Yes, we are definitely store. going to our local in Ocean City. We're in Ventnor. They're in Ocean City and we're going to go to our stitch store. Yeah, so we're excited Can't about wait. that. So it's been a good work week. Yes. So and, it's very um, exciting. Uh, we have exciting Halloween goodies coming out. Lots of exciting bags we've put out, that mommy's put out. And I have a lots of exciting um, colorways that I put mm. out. So if you haven't checked them out, check them out because they're a lot of mm. fun. Mine is all like witchy, Wiccan themed. Um, 
And on my Patreon, I filmed behind the scenes because we have an advent coming out that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's really nice. And I filmed all behind the scenes of the making of the colorways and the making of the bag and the making of the charms by Sandy Sears Creations. And if you'd like to see stuff like that, check out my Patreon. I'm PH Dyer on Patreon, and I do uh, a weekly vlog. Uh, you get to see all about my stitching, and then you get to see videos behind the scenes of those special making moments. Yeah. So, yeah, it's, if you're it's, into it's Halloween, good. it'll be fun She's to view very the behind good at the scenes. It. I mean, you really are. Um, speaking of Samantha, she is... Yeah, her twin sister. Yeah. So you may have seen her on one of the previous episodes. Yeah. She is going to take a break because she is very busy. She's got kids, obviously. Yeah, she's doing good. Her store is finally And yeah, off. her store is taking off. She's got a lot of wholesale, um, a lot of wholesale deals that she's mm -hmm. doing. So With uh, she's just really, really I'm busy. So she may be yeah. intermittently shown on here because she'll have a lot of um, needle minders that we'll show you. But she will stick to the up. Woolen Women. So if you guys want to check her out, she'll be on the Woolen Women from time to time. Um, aside from that, she's very busy, so we're going to give her some space yeah. to, uh, to do so her you thing. Yeah, know, we're here, so yeah. you know, we told her it's all right. So, yeah, so it's been a good week. Look, I'm going 10 feet away. What happened? I oh, just I keep do. doing the wrong thing. I can't help it. I don't know about you guys. I don't the care mistakes. what the back looks like. Oh. I don't care what the back <laughs> looks like. I can't the mistake. help it. It's hysterical. I got carried away making my little words. It's my first time really making words. <laughs> So you were excited that I forgot what they said. And I wrote the wrong thing. Well, she wrote the right thing. But I oh, no, you word. added a, a word. I forgot. I added a word again. I put, which the finest, the finest wool, wool since 1692. She wrote wool twice. I can't even. I did even. wool twice. Like, I just was, like, having fun and just kept going. I why didn't I see I already did wool? I don't know. Did you put it down? And then you Wait, my second up? wool. I, no, my second wool wasn't as, no, the first wool was better. Did you put it down and then pick it up and start I don't know. With wool? I have no idea. Yeah. <laughs> Are you going to tear it out? It's scary. <laughs> You're tearing it out, right? I have to. Yeah, it's wool. Yeah. Well, I could keep it. It is a. I'm having thing. a major struggle between knitting and stitching, but I think stitching won out like two weeks in a row now. Yeah. I've done nothing but stitch. Oh, it really gets. Like, I can't help it. You know. I even could... stitched by the pool. Right. The one time I yeah. went. Yeah. Now it's I'm becoming fun. like a recluse. Like, I don't even want to leave the house. I just need to stitch, and that's it. Right, and I'm acting like a designer. When I was doing, I started the witch hat. It's supposed to be over here. I was just like, oh, well, that looks like too much space. <laughs> Wait, she just changes the whole thing. Oh, my God. <laughs> and, and then she's It should have rang in my head. Then like, she's ding, going, ding, it's right? a pattern. Like, and I'm going, I don't know. They designed it. I didn't. So I, and I started, I had to move my, my, um, cause I got the witch all the way over. I mean, she barely has the room. It would have been perfect I if I had great. done it there, but it still looks nice. And it's just something funny we can talk about. I think it looks great. Cause I swear I'll stitch this again. I loved it. The double wool. I mean, you need to take a picture of I that know. I feel like leaving. I don't even want to rip it out. You have to rip Ripping it out. out is horrible. All I've done this week is yep. rip out. It's horrible. And I'll show you that when I show you my whips, but my gosh like every single time I stitch something I'd be so excited because I made so much progress and then I'd look at it and I'd be like oh and then I'd have to tear the whole thing out I know but it's not just stitching I'm doing that with my knitting too yeah she does it with her knitting I don't know what the problem is this week I know but every time I've completed something I've had to right. start off <laughs> it's that kind of week guys it just is. I don't know. I'm working a lot. I wonder if everybody's not. Well, they probably well, they are. All We're not weeks. different. They all know? have their weeks. I mean, I'm yeah. on medication that makes me forget every five seconds. So well, I could see me doing wool wool. <laughs> but then I don't follow the pattern. Who am I? I I'm never going to be able to count and do anything like that because what I can't. my excuse? I don't know. And have look, one. I just was like, oh, I'll start over here. I'm lucky it lined up with this. See, I think it's fine because it's like a painting. Then when I went to do the wheel, I got so scared. I thought the wheel and I was gonna have to rip. I did such a nice job stitching the, the wool here and I just made it. It's kissing it. What and I don't care. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can see it's like right on it. Kissing I'll show it. Close Look. Up. Yeah. I haven't done her legs her arms yet. I mean I did her hand, but I didn't do the wool going to it yet. 
because I did that on another thing and I don't like it. I didn't what do it right. That? The back stitch, you can't go real far. No, it doesn't they work need to that be right. Like, yeah, yeah, I need it to. You know. Well, wouldn't you back stitch? What is that, over one or over two? Uh, it's over one. Then you would back These stitch are back over stitched. one, wouldn't you? Um, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, everything's over Although one. Although some of them are, di uh, you go diagonal through it. Yeah, but do you, you know, remain like diagonal? Sarah, like it cuts through each square right. all the way up. Right, but you would keep back stitching over one each time, right? Yeah, no, it didn't look like people did that. I wonder. I wonder if you guys know the answer to that. Now, what was it again? Do you we back stitch over one? So you continually back stitch over each over one, one or do you go every few? I yeah. think you go every like few a longer, like a little bit. I you need go to look three that up, now and I'm then curious, do it three, then do it. Back stitch on some of mine. Yeah. So I'm curious about. But that. you know, they don't show it like that. They just show a line. And you know, of course, on my other thing, I just so now I got to fix it. Um, we've started to predominantly stitch in hand now. If you yeah. notice, we don't have our hoops on here anymore. Yeah, I'm like a, a real stitcher. Uh, okay. I did actually it's in my blood or something. I did actually take into account um a couple comments you guys had from last episode, and mm -hmm. I um uh, I realized like the remember I said with the different stitching patterns on the back, I had some weird squiggly line. Yeah. The stair step going Oh, on. yeah. Well, now I have the straight lines because I'm, yeah, I'm doing like it that correctly. Count. Yeah. So, so, yeah, I did kind you of did find out by learn, you know, learning. So, thank you to those that commented because that really helped. I mean, we're new stitchers. So yes. It, uh, yeah. it really helped. Really helped. We've been watching all the YouTube. Yeah. We have a, a lot some of favorites. Tube. A lot of floss tubes. A lot of tutorials for yeah. me. Me too. You know. Um, but we do mm -hmm. have some finished objects. You want to show your, um, start with your yes. finished objects? Okay. This was for that. Put these over here. Um, Look, we're buried in stitching. I, I know. Like oh, I love it. I was almost done. And I you got so uh, aggravated with myself because I, I didn't do the right thing. Because she did wool wool. <laughs> and I did wool wool. <laughs> the wool wool. I should have just left the L's out. And I wanted to do 2020, and I still stitched. I think you should. But now a y. I got space. I got all this space over here. I want to write something. I and think what you should need I write? to add a Y and do woolly wool. <laughs> no, there's not enough room. Woolly wool. No. I still need to rip out. Yeah. Oh, well. But what could we put here? Like something going down the side here might look nice. We'll have to think about. Oh, we'll have to think about that. I stitch from morning till night. Hmm. But it's spinning. Yeah, it's spinning. And look, these aren't even even. I, I think. was thinking like a... I'm always crooked, so it's a shame. I was thinking like a bobbin or something. You know? Yeah, but I don't know how to make that up. Well, it's basically a little cylinder. I think it would yeah. be too hard. Okay. Here, this is what I was talking about. Here's my finished object. I finished the uh, the planners. Yeah, uh, she finished the yeah, little and see my big things are not laying right. So these things up top yeah. are a bit loose. Yeah, so I gotta um, fix them. So she wants to fix those. But it's a cute But well, aside from that, I think your French knots are great. Yeah, I did good. Um, I think they look great. I pressed it, so I kind of pressed it. I love your little tassel now. at the end. Yeah. yeah, it's very pretty. Yeah. But these are not. Well, you just tighten them. Well, you know, I'm OCD. Sure, because I kind of see them fine now. I think once if I got it into a picture and I just fixed it real cool. fast. Yeah, I think it would be fine. I would be able to do it. But even here. Dog, go on. Go on. My dog is scared of the iron. All right, then lay down. Oh, lay down, buddy. Yeah, all so right. this came out pretty good. Oh, I got a little dippy here, too. But oh, it's oh, all right. Most of it's great. Uh, yeah, I was proud I of myself. It's the right first there. one I've ever finished. And now this will be a finished object, but you know. Yeah, that looks great. I think. Yeah, I'm trying to keep it nice so it okay. doesn't. I finished my summer I know, small. I love it. I couldn't see the fabric. Let's do that. So I finished my yeah. summer small. It's really pretty. It. Let's Even see her if we changing can... was good changing. You should tag Lizzie and, and Kate. Show them how you change the trees. Is it not working? There we go. Um, I changed the hedges here, which would have had just brown squares in mm -hmm. the middle, and I changed it to French knots because I wanted it to look like roses. Yeah. 
Um, and then oh, this pretty. was a nightmare down below. That took me f like three tries. Yeah. But it came out really great. It's very pretty. I really love it. Job. For my first actual cross stitch project, yeah. I think it came out. It did. Really good. Now we just got to finish it. So we, we got some things for that we wanted to show you. Yeah. Um, I really love it. I think it's adorable. And I have like three more. Yep. And I have like three more that I can. I can stitch for that for like for next summer that I didn't use because this pack came with like. Four little oh, projects for summer smalls. Here you go. So I have even more summer smalls to do. I just put them down, and I'm I'm really getting into yeah, fall stitching now. Yeah, we're doing the, now. Yeah, the fall is great. Um, I can't believe. I'm but I was so this. happy to finish one Almost. like for the end of the summer. So my that was like my summer stitching, which is pretty funny because it's like the smallest thing ever. But for a new stitcher, I thought it was pretty good. Yeah. So. And I got some bags I made, Halloween bags, that are just great. They're cute. Yeah, her other finished objects. Yeah. So she has like a yarny witch bag. Yeah. They're all box bottom. Same fabrics inside. This one has, they have this like uh, spider web yeah. type fabric, orange and black, which is yeah. really cute. And then this one went up today. It's like a little potion, but it actually is stitched. It appears to be stitched. Yeah. Which is pretty cute. And she gave it this like polka dot tag yeah. and handle with a polka dot inside. Yeah. Again, it's like box bottom, so super cute. Really cute for stitching or for Yeah. Um or for knitting. So really adorable. Really cute. I like them. They were the two. So those are some of her finished objects. And that's my only finished one that's summer smalls, I think. Yeah. Um, and my summer small was stitched on a 32 count light mocha Belfast, which I really like. Um, I thought it was really. Fabric. Hold on. There we go. Um, I thought it was really pliable. So, like, while I was hand stitching, I liked holding it in my hand. I thought it was like easier to to hand stitch with mm -hmm. but what I didn't like is how uneven it is so like as a new stitcher I was kind of struggling it's over two and sometimes the holes were a little uneven and I yeah. like at the end when I had to do that honeycomb right you kind of like structure at the bottom it took me four times to get it, to straight, get it straight because it actually curved a little yeah and I ended up having so you have up, like it, they're supposed to be almost diamond like and then you put more in the middle and they yeah. were all off yeah. by one and I had to keep tearing it out no. so I liked the fabric but I think it was a little more advanced like somebody who's been stitching yes because it's the 30 well, it's 32 count yeah. I can't even see it it's crazy this was 18 count that's what I like this so this is my yeah. favorite so that was a little rough okay and um, um do you want to show them your hawks run I guess we're on oh, whips yeah. now we're going to show our whips this, this. Uh, some more. I did a little bit more. Oh, yeah, I, got, I had the J. I finished the star. I did the you know the rest of July, and I did all this part here. Yeah, so it's the, the left flag pole. In July. Now and I'm gonna do the flag. She's changing this a little bit too. Yeah, because yeah, perfect. is it focusing? Looks like it. She's changing this a little bit too because July is supposed to have an extra star on the end. Yeah, I, I couldn't do it. The white was killing and me. Can't see. I don't blame you because if I'm being honest, the white star does not show up that well. And I was talking I don't about so this either. on my Patreon, and one of my patrons suggested to outline the star with blue, which yeah, I tried doing, but I hated right, the way because like the star isn't exactly like perfectly pointy and it looks strange outlined. Yep. So what I ended up doing with any other white that I did was do two threads instead of one. To make it darker. Because this is yeah. one thread over But one. I already did this one, and I thought, no, I better not. And I'll show you what that looks like, because I actually... Because this was supposed to be done in a, in a color around it, boxed. Oh, w, yeah, and I, I didn't remember. do it. I didn't like the way it was. When I first, before I messed up and had to start over, I didn't like it. Here, I'll show them. So, it's my July... Here has the stars and you can kind of like barely see them but look at the sailboat I did two threads of white on the sailboat and it shows up a lot better so I think I like that a lot better so that's I worked on the rest of the fireworks 
I got July done and the sailboat yeah. since the last time I showed you guys. And then you started so, on... So, and then I started on August because I think what I'm going to do is go through the months and get what I can done and then like just finish leave it like, like I did July yeah. and come back around and finish it later. Yeah. So this is dog days of summer. Never and really feel. if I'm being honest, I had to start making things up with the tree and put it overlaid like behind yeah. where the words overlay the tree. Yeah. Because this is supposed to be like further out, giving yeah. the words more room and the tree was supposed to start further <laughs> over. And and you and you don't realize yeah. it's you're deep in. And you know what? By the time I really want to rip it out. I was like, I'm not ripping this out. I had so it's much It's heavier fun. fabric. It's like raw fat, but it's really nice. It's great to stitch yeah. on. I'm in love. Because if you see here, I stitch in hand with this on here. Yeah. All you did was pull it on. It really she left it caves loose. in loose. This is an 18 count Rustica Natural Ada. Yeah. It, I absolutely so nice. love it because it's super even. Look at you our July's look so, so different. so fast. And how weird is that? Why do they look different? And look, your box. What do you mean? Look how tiny mine is. <laughs> Mine's tiny. Oh, there's more space between them. No, you got. It looks like you've got a bigger box going on. Oh, I do. Why? Huh? We did the count. I might have to count yours. You did this with the witch's one too. Yeah. Interesting. I might be crooked too, but I think it's this. No, but you're. Are you it's sure? Crooked. Wait, wait. Yeah. Look how many more. Are you sure? No, it's no. A little it's, more. It's not. It's exactly the same. Oh my God! It's it looks your. So different I think to it's me. your tension. Oh. That looks super different. Your work. They look space. This is space. Look, and I did. Sp I, I already are, went like it said to. I did like it said to. That's a lot over. Yeah. Oh. And why are? Oh, this, I did move this. Yeah, I'm that's a liar. Not, this, See, then I. She just changes stuff. it. <laughs> Uh, I'm type A. I started changing. I have to it. have it the way it's supposed to be. No, I'm I'm just going to be a designer yeah, because just I just keep it. moving things, thinking no. this is a good thing. But it's not a bad thing. Like, Hopefully, it's not a bad right thing. Here. I think you'll be fine. What I'm concerned yeah, about this is the flagpole. The flag the length. is going to crash right. <laughs> it, it might. It's gone. Up. But it's you it. can't barely see that, so Wait, I'm just going to do it. Is it though? If that's the case, mine's going to do that. Where too. is it? Where's the pattern? Oh. Let's see. Oh, it's right here. I got it. There we go. No, it's close, but it's like two rows. Two rows. Yeah, it'll be fine. Under it. Oh, see, so yeah, your flagpole see, comes a flag little pole. too far up. So just move the flag a bit down on the pole. Yeah, I'm just going to start here. Yeah, you're going to have to. Right under it. She just says approximate. <laughs> She's I'm crazy. Like, this she is a whale. Oh, and another thing I did wrong on this. Down here was supposed to be a different color. The gray was supposed to be for the whale that goes here. There's a whale right here. Mm -hmm. And I forgot that fast and started doing these. In gray. In gray. Like, I did it in the wrong color. Well. So I'm not ripping it out. It looks too good and I'm not doing it. Well, it's fine. It looks fine. It really it's does. a podium. We'll be fine. But and I'll have enough to do the whale. You know what, though? Yeah. I started to get obsessed on this piece. I mean, I've been stitching it for the last three days. Uh -huh. um, I really, I really love it. So. I know. Me and I'm I loving that it's the August. months. August, I think, is really awesome. It's actually dog days. Yeah, dog days of summer. I'm going to show them the picture. Yep. So, so this is our picture. So this is July, just so you know what you're looking at. This is July. See, we have the fireworks and the boats coming about with the July. And this is dog days of summer. So, those are the two we're working on. Yeah, I see. Your tree was in a little. Yeah, I mean, and that's fine. Yeah. I had so much fun stitching it. I'm not going to tear it you all out. You should have started with that. this, and then you would have. Yeah, well, the tree I thought right. this is right at the corner. I thought I'll take that yeah. over. Somebody talked to me, and then that was done. Yeah, and that's what, as fast as it happened, yeah, everybody knows that's fine. what it does. So I mean, I'm, I'm still absolutely loving it. I think the words I still do too. overlaying a little bit is fine. I yeah. don't have a problem with it. So no, I love it. Uh, so I'm excited about it. I know, and I'm doing it on here, and I'm loving it. Putting it on my lap, on my chair. I am still waiting. I couldn't do all the fabric in my lap. It'll be three months on September 2nd. 
for my stand. For her stand, yeah. And it's not she got the it from lady's Russia. fault. I just ordered and didn't realize she it was even from thanked Russia. her for not uh, taking it back. And the money. She said Canceling. that she said the postal service is shut down there except by boat so it's coming by boat and she begged me to please just be more patient so it i gave really it another month down when it got here yeah it's crazy so i gave it another month and it's still not here and this will be the third month so i'm just waiting but it's yeah. not her fault it's I don't just have covid to drink I don't have anything. you want me to get it's, you something it's way over there yeah good please Thank I'm funny. I'm changing everything. I, I think that's person. funny. Like I said, it's like a painting. It is. It really I does. It feels it. like that. It really does. Okay. okay what else do we have? Oh, God, I need to count. I can't. Um, oh, we have our farmhouse Christmas one. Do you want to show Oh, yeah. Those? Yeah, yeah. So we participated in Jolly July. Sort of. Sort of. <laughs> I mean, I did a lot, though, because I think I did on this a yeah. pretty good amount. Not the whole July though. July was rough with pop up and all. Yeah, we like, had I my feel like it was rough. Her, her um, grandfather passed. Like we said it on the last one. Yeah, I feel it's like it's weird. That. Why did it's I still two weird of these that he's in gone. here? Why is that happening? I don't know. This is in here and this is in here. I know I had this one in here and I'm not even using oh, that's it. That's weird. Uh yeah, so at the end of July I wrapped up everything I was doing and kind of got right. more of it done. This is on that eighteen count rustico natural Ada as well. Yeah, this got all messed up. We both had to pull out. And if you remember, we were both stitching the same crooked. thing. This is Farmhouse Christmas Little Red Barn by the Little House Needleworks. You want to show yours? Yeah, I just did the little... I do, I'm doing it sideways like this on this fabric. And um, I had to rip it all out and start over, and that's all I got. So, I really this might be hard it. to see. They're like little white snowflakes. I've been possessed by the one, you know, the rich um, one. And they make a little white snowflake border. There we can go. barely see it. I have a hard time working with white. It, it is not the best for this. Yeah, one, it's I very think. hard. I think it's just too light, but I know. um, so yeah, I finished the border, but I talked about this oh, last two, time. Two over two. Yes, I talked about this last time. I had trouble with the border, same as you, mom. I yeah, couldn't get the border did, to meet up. I ended right. up finally adding a stitch, and then the border met after mm -hmm. tearing it out twice. And after that, I started flying. Like, I got the rooftop done. I got the flowers on the rooftop done. Like, those poinsettia type a things. Okay. There's a couple of snowflakes here. And so, I really started to get into it. And then July ended, and I thought, let me put it down and start August on the hawk run that I yeah. just showed you. And so, I haven't picked it up since, but I did make some pretty good progress right at the end of July there. So, look how pretty the roof is. I know. I can't wait to get to it. So, now I'm going to be moving on to the uh, red barn, which I'm excited about. I know. So, oh, here's the other needle. Well, we have to have a segment about uh, our friend. Who's our friend? Equipment 17. Oh, right. Gotta tell them all Do you have all it. that stuff? Where is yes, it? Yes, it's right behind me. Okay. Well, do are, that we at, are we at acquisitions? Yeah, I just showed this. Let me see. Oh, you showed the spinning witch. This is yours. You told what that was on? Yeah. And the spinning witch is by the little stitcher. I have stitcher. other things, but I haven't done anything on them, so. Yeah, we'll leave them for next time. Next time. I did the same thing. I left some out. Um, the spinning witch that she showed you a few minutes ago is by Laura Romola, uh, by the little stitcher. Yeah. And everything we've shown you is on the called four colors in DMC. We haven't quite ventured into uh, silks or anything like that yet. Um, we were waiting to go to the stitch store, maybe splurging a little. And then, I guess the last thing I can show you that I was working on, which I just literally did something on for the first time in a while, yep. is this uh, Witch's Brew. And I got just the border outlined like I showed you last time. And I got, I'm starting to fill in the top border that will have orange and black in it. And it is this. It is the Witch's Brew. It is by Sugar Stitches Cross Stitch Designs. And this is also stitched on... I can't even get it in the hole. Or this is stitched on an 18 count raw natural Ada. Again, with the called four colors. 
And I just love this fabric because it has this like green shimmery uh, witchy kind of vibe to it because uh, it's got that green tinsel kind of stuff in the fabric. So. so that's what I'm working on while we're sitting here and I haven't made any progress other than that with it because uh, I had put it down for a while while I participated in Jolly July. Okay, uh, now we are on to acquisitions. Yeah, I can't run. All right, yeah, we got quite a few things. We went to Hobby Lobby. We went a little crazy. We went a little crazy, but we got everything on sale, so that was good. Up here, I'm going to show them the, pen, uh, the uh, needle minders yeah, we got. This away. I couldn't resist. Yeah, and we they were got so the excited. Backing. They look handmade. Yeah. Who are these by? <sighs> what was she called? Mm. Oh God, I forget. Yarnology. Yarnology and Stitchology. They have yes. like these cute. And normally we buy off of Etsy or from One Two Three yes. Stitch. But these actually look like some. I gotta look them up because they look handmade. Like they somebody do. actually yeah. designed them. I think they it got says Floss Girl. Yeah, isn't it cute? And if you look at the back, they have these adorable little stoppers on them. Yeah. And this one says, stitching is a lifestyle. It's so cute. Very cute. And this one is That's a little floss. How it. adorable is that? I couldn't resist. So cute. So cute. So we got them. Yeah, you're taking this one. Yeah, the floss girl one. We got that, and we got this little box to put our little flosses. All our extra our, flosses. Our, well, this is going to go in that. Yeah. So see, right now we have all our extra all little our extras in projects there. in there, yeah, and it's super adorable. There, so it's got little bees on it. And we'll put these in there. We so got scissors. We got scissors. That we're have. Take care of them. I don't know if you can Can't see it on here. So these have like a little yarn ball. Oh, you kind of oh. see it there. What's oh. happening? Tragedy strike. Yeah. Okay, let me get it. So they have like a little fell. yarn ball on the scissors. Yeah, it's adorable. Which is so cute. Yeah, we couldn't resist these either. Hobby Lobby had some really good stuff on surprise. Well, and you can imagine after you get out from COVID, yeah, we're like, you go a little know, nuts. Uh, yeah. You know? Yeah, I know. It's a shame. I got some fabrics, but I got these at Joanne's. Oh, okay. I got in case we want to finish. Oh, I yeah. Some, I'm, I think I'm going to use this blue one with that summer small. I'm going to with that... um. The one I just finished, you know, the little uh, the floral plants. piece. I think I'm gonna put it in. I'm gonna put it over there, mm -hmm. like yours. But I'm gonna uh, do it in strips and wrap it around the, uh, the hoop. Oh, around the hoop, like I yes. did. Yes. Okay, I like that. And then that. I bought. What is it here? I bought this um, ribbon. Oh, ribbon! I love this. Yeah. So I got all colors: black, Very blue, cute. and and red. So lots of gingham in different colors. Well, we bought them. And, and We're really excited about uh, yeah, Chelsea finish. and Priscilla's. The Priscilla. Yeah, the pretty, I went, when they come out, plaids. I'm going to be ordering them too. Yeah, because yeah, the plaids are just great. Yeah, we I got love our that. thing. And we got thing. fabric. Yeah, so, we bought this fabric, even weave. I don't know if anybody's ever stitched on these. If you have, I've heard let them us know what you think it. of it. It's I've heard this word before too. Zwegart. Artiste. And it's what is it? Zwegart. Artiste. We got them at Hobby Lobby. We don't know how they are. Yeah, we got 18 and 28 count. We we usually buy off of the one, two, three stitch, but these are the Zweigart 18 count Ada Artiste brand. And we're trying 28 count. Oh, and that too, yeah. Yeah, we want to try 28 count. So we got two little ones of that and a giant one of 18 count. Yeah. That I love. I can see better. Oh, and what's it? But I feel like I can see this. Yeah, I feel like I really do. I think I'll be all right. Oh, and I got myself a lamp. Oh, here. What did we do with the lamp? I got myself a nice, heavy, it even comes off and goes on a clip. So I'll be able to. Um, yeah, we clip it to our chair. To my chair, the back of my chair. It's excellent to stitch with. And then this is real heavy. I just don't remember what it's called. Hmm. Oh, here it is. Magnifying lamp. Who's it by? Lamp buy? adapter table stand. Didn't say. You just got it off of Amazon, didn't you? Yeah. I'll try to link it in case. Yeah, because we got a, a model here. Oh, okay. Because I'm loving it. It magnifies so you can and lights up so you and can look twists. in. And this twists. And this does all it kinds of craziness. Ways. Yeah. 
so, you guys know it, it makes all that you know yeah it twists in any shape you shape want, you want so it's nice it's really and the nice. light I is like so it. bright and the light. I can barely sit in the same room I know. while she's stitching. But it's nice. Here. I can fix it so it doesn't hit you. Not like the other one. Yeah, yeah. You know, because I don't want to blind you. And, and we, then, got, we got needles. Yeah, got needles. And I like these needles. I got a Hobby little Lobby tin Clover. that says Peace Love Yarn. Um, It's called a little needle art tin. I got this to keep uh little notions. I have some buttons in here. And I have some extra threads and things like that in here. Yeah, that's cute. Yeah. I didn't get one of them. Oh, what about your share. book? Show your book. We'll do the math. Show, show the math stuff. You want me to? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. I got this on Joanne. Uh, Joanne's for half price. Yeah. To finish. Oh, to put our all our patterns in. All our in. patterns are going to go in here. And right? hang it on the wall because yeah. we're running out of space for the floor. I know we're like hoarding. So that'll floor. work out. Here, hold these because we'll talk about them next. Oh, yeah. And then we got this paddle to finish something with. Not yeah. bad. We got it all on sale. Yeah. And then we got cute. this one. Yeah. And see, I'm torn yeah. between putting the summer small, a winter picture, and a spring or something. Yeah. Or if I want to just or do the summer small. Or we use the magnets and we put, and change, change them, out. them out. Yeah. So, and put gingham on the back. Yeah. Or sticky board. Yeah. And put a magnet. I mean, like at least we're starting. Here's the, the right side. Yeah. So we got this some really nice side. stuff for finishing, I think. Yeah, for, for finishing. I'm it. Can't wait to show you those FFOs next time. Because we're going to try to finish yeah, them. Yeah, because we don't know if we're sharing it, what we're doing. We'll try to finish them for we the might. next episode, I think. Um, yes, so you guys can for the next see time. It. Definitely. Oh, and then I bought yeah. a pattern. Are we going to tell them about what we bought two nights Let's ago? Go. What is it? It's not in here. Oh, it's in here. And you got to tell them what we bought uh, two nights ago. Or oh, was that yeah. last night? That was last night. I got this pattern, the Spinning Witches. So this Me, is Samantha, and Andrea. <laughs> very cute because it's like three. It's like Get the it? three of us, yeah. We should make it say I'm excited. I'm the woolen women it. below. Oh, my God. Love Maybe that. I will. Maybe I will. This I can is write also that. by The Little Stitcher. Yeah. If you guys were interested. I love what is this going to be stitched on? Um, the... Uh, the 18 the raw. count raw, uh, what is it, raw natural? Nat yes, mm. raw natural. 18 count rustico natural Ada. Yeah, the same one, because I have Cause more We of really it. love that one. I yeah, really it's really good. It's got good uh, holes. But it says like the three spinners at the bottom. Oh, and I made this bag. I don't want to say the woolen women. Of course I kept it. I love it. It's great. I'm obsessed. It really if is. you guys check out our Instagrams, I just want to let you know every time I post one, it sells. It's crazy. Yeah, like it's funny. everybody loves the little red the truck. The little red truck. We are equally as obsessed now. I yeah. can't stop. With the Anybody wants truck. one, just DM us. DM us, yeah. Because uh, I, I can make them to order. I just don't want to be piling things and making things I don't have to make. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I, I to exert myself like that for no reason. And then we got presents. Yes. <laughs> Oh my God! Customer of mine. I'm so excited. Her name's Jerry. She um, I had asked her some questions when we first started uh, cross stitching because I it's a whole nother thing with money. I'm disabled, so I'm thinking, you know, how do I get into something I know it's more money, you know? Because of course we have to go to the indie died and all that, you know. <laughs> But because uh, when we did that in the beginning of knitting, I did everything. That's what made me make project bags because I, I didn't have money to buy those bags. So I would make, I made them. And then I, everyone's like, oh, you got to sell them, you know. And then I thought, well, that's great because then I could buy that yarn. So now we're thinking of that, the, the what are they, dye works? Yeah. Oh, all the good. Uh, well, because we always stitch in DMC. I kind of want to know what it's like. The to vibrance stitch of with them. Yes. Else. And I am a dyer. So I know. I need to know what these are. And we don't want to, we can't get into that right now. We also want right. to support other dyers. Other dyers, nice, yes. You know? It's very neat, we think, that they do And then this. it really is like a painting because you can do variegated ones. Like, yeah, you can pick what that. you want instead of what someone else picked for yeah. you. Yeah, I think that's really neat. Especially that I'm trying to design my own thing. So tell her what she's saying. <laughs> so Jerry, she she was early on bought a bag from me. Last three years I've been open. So sweet. And she sent us a bunch of cross stitch. So great. We forgot the one over there. Sorry, this is. By I lunch, have one by itself. I mean, we're talking like look, we are starting this. Like twenty five or thirty of them. Look, it's crazy. We got this one. 
That one was We're dying. Good. I cannot wait to do this. I have to go. I have fabric now because we got this fabric. And uh, we just have to go to the kitchen store. Unless we want to have more coffee grab... dyed one. No, I, That's I just. so light. Well, it's we can coffee dye it. Remember, she was yeah. showing with a Q tip and some coffee. We can. Mm. I think we could do it. Yeah. We're doing it. We really want to do it. I just decided. This one's a schoolhouse. Apple, heart and hand, schoolhouse sample. I loved that for Coda's little school It has the fabric. Room. She was Let so show generous them. to share these with us. So this is a little school sampler. I have to buy all the thread. <laughs> Sorry, guys. There's a little bit of a glare. This rabbit has to be done by next Easter. Um, They saw this one. This is the Nantucket oh, one. So cute. Love that. Oh, this is spring. Ah, oh, so Chis sweet. Spring. It's a little bunny. And look, she gave us one like this. It's the now, little house. We just showed you we started this one. She gave us yeah. the whole collection, guys. There yeah. is like four or five little patterns to the set Into in here. Set. So that's really exciting. Yes. So exciting. And then, oh my gosh, you know I'm loving bees because of my summer small. She gave us this beautiful. Yeah, Samantha and Andrea like what that. What is this called? The blue flower quilting bee. I like bee. it, but I don't think I would stitch it. I love it. I would stitch it. I Samantha it. wants to stitch it too. Um, and then this one. This one's hard to see because it doesn't really show it that well on the front. But it's basically a snowman and it says winter's quiet, moonlighter's tune. Uh, snowman laughter gone too soon. Very cute. And has some like quilted patterns in between the words. She even gave us like yeah, the threads the in the back, the kit. She actually yeah. has the, them kitted up. It starts you off. Um, this one's Old Crazy. Glory. And again, it has some like quilted sort of patterns oh, on there beads. with lettering and stuff. Yeah, she's just like, it's fully in there. So really Very excited. Generous. And she shared these with us. We are so excited. And we so can't. So as we get back into this, we're going to have to. We can't thank her enough. It yeah, was so sweet to send this stuff. Thing we ever. have stitching enough to do for like ever. I know. I mean, so. And what is so her great. name on Instagram? Uh, Quilt Knit 17. Okay. And I'll put that up here just in case. Right. Um, and her name is Jerry. We gotta go get them. Lots and again, them. she's been buying project bags yeah. for my mom for some time, and she's very yeah. sweet. So, so sweet to do that. So yeah, she sent us some goodies. So yeah, the Seashore great. Stitchers got presents. I know. So exciting. She got something. I was so excited about yeah, that. Me too. You know, because you always see all the podcasters. You're like, oh, I wish I had something. <laughs> now we always, guys. We run the Woolen Women. If you haven't heard or haven't checked us out before on yeah. the same it's the woolen women channel yeah that's because we started the woolen women and then when we started stitching we started right. the seashore stitchers um but as the woolen women we give out giveaways every, every week. single week yep. that we podcast because it's so, so much weekly. fun to give and everything. it's not like little things it's like a whole skein of yarn yeah. yarn in a bag a whole yeah. set or we give away like samantha's knitting jewelry yeah. and we never like get presents so to get a present was yeah, special it was, wonderful. it was super special very very generous so of her. thank you so much jerry that was really sweet yeah very sweet i was really excited about um it. and Loving to it. log all our progress we got journals i've started mine have you started yours uh, a little bit oh Not that's much. cute she put crafting with my twins on it so I we actually there. got these books off of yes, etsy I'm so lucky. I will link who the book is by. They're like these recycled notebooks. They have like brown, uh, yeah. natural looking pages. I made my, I used the white markers that we bought. Yeah. Crafting, Crafting with, with twins. my twins. Mine's a little more loud. I did some stickers and it's my yeah. making journal. It's got some like quotes on there. Will the permanent marker go through? Uh, it didn't on mine. Maybe I'll use this one. Not on the front page. So I've started putting. Mm -hmm. And this is something I share with my patrons. I don't really show it anywhere else. It's something special between me and them. Yeah. Um, but I'll show you a little glimpse. I put like my, and I got this idea off of Mandarin's podcast. What's her name, Melody? Yeah, Mel Melody, Melody. And she runs Mandarin's podcast and she does a making yeah, journal. Yeah, so each time she finishes a project, it goes in her making journal and gets logged on like little notes on what she did or like the materials that she used. So for me, I put like the hand dyed yarns I use and the designer, what my little garment looked like. And what I'm gonna start doing is putting the, the same thing for my stitching projects. 
So like when I finished Witch's Brew, maybe I'll put a little swatch of the fabric in there. Yeah. Uh, maybe a little. Oh, it's so cute. I think I'm going to make like a tassel using all the different colored threads. That's reused there. And yeah. put it in the book just like my little knitting poofs. I know, it looks so, so nice. So. I think it's going to be super cute. Right I now I just it. have knitting in there, but I'm definitely going to do my summer small. Yeah. Um, but if you want to check out making stuff like that, check out the PH Dyer Patreon and you get to see yeah. all this behind the scenes stuff. Yeah. Are fun. you going to do that with yours too? Yeah. Definitely. Have you started yours? Uh, no, I only wrote that and I wrote on the back page to see if it would put crafting. Oh, okay. Yeah, we ordered these white pens. I yeah, to see if they would work. Well, but I like that. I use... Um, I, gotta, I was going to start with the uh, the old Nantucket. Oh, okay, yeah. And I was starting with um, old, Na old Nantucket, and uh, I'm going to put that first, and then this one, spinning three spinning witches. I'm only going to put what I finish in there. Yeah. So I'll wait till I finish them. Oh yeah, but I'm saying that's how I'm going to do it. When you finish it, yeah. okay. Yeah, I want to start that. Well, actually, I might just start the page, like put the next, so I remember to get it finished. Get it done. That's right. a good idea. Yeah, it'll help, help me get along a With little bit. With stitching, you might actually have to do whips in the journal because it takes. Yeah, so long it takes to so long them. to do them. That's a big picture. I also would like a little swatch, and a, I'm going to draw a diagram on how I plan to finish it, finish the object. Right. I think that's a really because in the spur of the moment, you know, you get a great idea, you're like that would look great, and then you get home and you're like. Wait. What did I say? What? what did I think? And then you have no idea what you said, so I think that'll be good for that too. Where yeah, that it can, can leave us, uh, get, uh, make us accountable, like yeah, I think that'll know. help. And Samantha just ordered um, little books, calendar books for us, and um, I'm gonna put it in there too, because yeah. the big journal one, it's just big. I actually and really I like going. the size. I thought it was gonna be too small. Yeah. Oh, I when like I hers. saw it, but I like oh, the these, size of that. Perfect. I think yep. that's perfect We're to making, fill a page. Yep. Yeah. Her making's perfect. All right, do we have anything else? No, that's it for me, unless you have something yeah. else. Oh, I'm dropping mm -hmm. the needle. It's been a lot of fun, all this stuff. We're doing a little hard because we're working, you know, but we're getting it done because I do a lot of her uh, yarn now. I have to knit up. What a yeah, thought. we're knitting that look, crazy. Look, and I... <laughs> I was given all this yarn. I do want to That's get great. Into, I would have loved to get into dying threads, but that's oh, a whole know. other set no, maybe of, next year. It's a whole other ball game. It's a whole other ball game, yeah. So it's, we'll see. Maybe someday. Yeah. We'll see. I would just like to support, you know. Yeah, I want to. And now I'm in a little better of a situation. If we do go to the stitching store, guys, I'll bring you along and maybe we'll put yeah, some of that definitely, in here so yeah. you can see what our stitching store looks like. Yeah, definitely. It, it, someone said it's more of a needle point, so that's going to be a little upsetting. Is it? Yeah, and then we have to go to Kate May. Kate May's our next one. Kate May has some good ones in the, the little shops and all. Yeah. They have yeah. a knitting one there, right next, like next door. Yeah, they have, they're real close. Yeah. Knitting oh, and... Well, uh, check that out. I had called fun. that uh, yarn place. I didn't have a yarn place there. Yeah, and um, we should go visit her, too, the yarn lady. Is this yours or mine? It's I one I found. Here. No, no, you have one. Oh, you took oh it. here it is. Yeah. yeah, this is empty. I don't oh, know what I had it in. She's been making these little thread binders. Yeah, I didn't end up getting them in my shop, Very though. Cute. So bad. But okay. if anybody like anything, just let me know. Oh, I love I'll them. make it for you. My prices are very reasonable. I don't have one in here. I'm That's actually going to put for. this on here. A spinning think, witch. I'm putting it there. Does that stay? A little Disney. Okay, um, I think that's all we have for today. Yeah. Um, I it's didn't mention fun. in the beginning, if you're new, we are a bi-weekly podcast, or at least we try to be. Yeah, I know. Uh, sometimes been, we're a little late, a but um, we try to at least give ourselves some time to stitch yeah. some stuff so we have some things to show you. Yeah. Um, we'll try to get some of our projects finished, at least one actually finished, finished, so maybe we can show them next time. Yeah, we're definitely going to go get, yeah. get into that because I want mine done. Uh, but if you like what you saw, please like the video, please yeah. subscribe. Uh, we're also the Woolen Women. We have a new episode of that that came out last week. Check that out if you're interested in other crafty things. Yeah. Uh, and until next time, we'll see you later. Okay. Bye. Bye.